Hello everyone, how are you doing today? In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to upgrade your hard drive from the mechanical hard drive to an SSD drive on your Acer Aspire E15 500 series. This can be anything through the 500 E15 series. So what you want to do first quickly, you want to flip over your laptop, remove all the screws at the bottom cover, and then all the screws are the same size, so don't worry about the mismatching them, they're right over here. Don't worry about these three right there. You wanna remove all these screws from the bottom cover. Once you remove all the screws, you wanna pull the caddy where the DVD ROM goes. You wanna pull this out. And under this one, there's gonna be three more screws, which are these ones over here, these three screws. And that's all. So let's put up this one over here. Once you remove all the screws, what do you want to do? You want to grab your guitar pick and you want to shove it right in between the top and bottom cover in the corner where the DVD ROM is. That's where I usually start. And then work your way through on the back side. Just wiggle around. Do by the DVD side and do this front end. Right, and then once you have this side up, you just want to push it towards the audio jack, towards the fan. Uh, don't push too hard because there's a cable right in the front. You want to remove this cable. This is the audio cable, the speaker cable right there on the bottom cover. So you want to put that to one side. So right here we have the hard drive and we have the battery right up here. You don't need actually to disconnect the battery if you already powered up. So what you want to do, there's no screws right here. You want to just actually pull the hard drive towards the and this USB jack over here. Don't pull too hard, just so gently. Um, this is a Toshiba drive. You want to just unhook the protective rubber stuff that they have on the side, the caddy. Remove the drive. Grab your SSD drive. In this case, I'm going to use a 120 gig. Make sure you put it on the same way. Just stick it right there. Make sure it's nice and snugly. And put it down. Put the jack connectors. Let it slide it back in. All right. That's it. That's pretty much how you upgrade your hardware. Once you put that in there, you don't need to disconnect the battery again. You want to bring the top bottom cover, plug in the speaker cable, put the jack side, the audio jack in first. You have to, it's kind of tricky, but you just have to move it around once you get inside it. There you go. Then you're going to push down the corners, the front. And you want to hear those click sounds. Once you have those, you want to put the three flat screws right on the DVD ROM or your caddy. And then you're going to put this one down and put the rest of the screws at the bottom cover. And then you guys start. You can actually do a clone of your hard drive to the SSD drive or just do a fresh install on the new one. I always recommend do a fresh install if you want to do a new hard drive. That depends. How you like it anyway thanks for watching guys i hope you guys like this video if you liked it click that thumbs up button and if you have any comments or requests leave them in the comments and i'll try to answer them as soon as i can thanks for watching guys and i'll see you in my next video